Augusta Department of Public Safety facing a federal lawsuit. One man claims they violated his civil rights after arresting him for a murder he says he couldn't have committed. Alan Michael Johnson alleges the department kept him locked up months after they knew he was innocent. And as our Hallie Turner reports, in the past 10 days, that case has moved over to federal court. What began as an arrest for murder is now a civil rights lawsuit sitting in the hands of the federal court. Alan Michael Johnson filed the lawsuit May of last year. He says five public safety officers arrested and charged him in the murder of a 19-year-old back in 2018, but claims days later the officers had information showing it was not possible for Alan to have committed the murder. Alan says rather than taking the steps necessary to get him out of jail without charges, the officers pushed forward in the prosecution, keeping him in jail for two years. The lawsuit also claims before Allen was released from jail, his constitutional right to meet with his lawyer in private was taken from him as officers eavesdropped on the conversation. The lawsuit says they were grossly negligent in their training and did not care that they were violating his rights. All of this caused long-term effects on Allen, including mental anguish, lack of freedom, and more. In August of last year, Aiken County filed their response listing out multiple reasons why they believe they are not liable. In Augusta, Hallie Turner on your side. So Aiken in the response says the officers were acting in good faith and it ends by saying any damage Allen suffered was due to a third party they had no control over. That'll all be for a federal court to sort out.